Hey guys, do some mess here with another video. Uh, today we're gonna be looking at sheep. You had enough looking at sheep yet? No. All right, let's go see uh, where we can buy them at uh, to start with. And I think you have to buy them over at Mary's Farm. So, uh, here, yes. Let's go visit. All right, so you start out here. Hit F1 so you can see your options. Open animal menu. Uh, sheep are 4,000. They don't take a whole lot to uh, for upkeep and for feed and all that kind of stuff. It's um, uh, like hay or grass, and that's it. So uh, that's all you will really need for food. Pigs, on the other hand, need uh, quite a bit of stuff. So do cows. Let's go to the animal menu real quick and check it out. So uh, always need water. Always, so that's one thing. We'll look at that when we get over there. Require a clean feeding area, and some require straw. These guys do not require straw on this map. Uh, not that I can tell. I'm getting 100% productivity out of them um, by just feeding them and watering. That's it. So 100% grass, hay or grass, uh, and water. That's all you should need. Um, do keep in mind that the higher your productivity, the faster the wool comes, and the more likely you are to reproduce and get a new animal. So... Uh, you have to keep cleanliness at 100% and keep their food and water really high and that kind of stuff. So uh, you're also going to need something to clean up after them because they are messy animals. So as you can see there, a little green spot on the ground. I'm going to take it and just dump it right back over in the... Uh, there we are. Hello? Okay, we're not. We're going to keep it. We'll keep it for later. But uh, I bought this little guy here. Uh, just for this job just to just to be over here move stuff around and also uh, You see my big pile of grass here. I cut my one field that I have that I'm using for uh, Silage wrap for bale wrap silage. I cut it turned it over for grass. You see the water trough there It's full the water actually looks pretty good in this game uh, It's not bad. It's got like a film over it like it would be if it were sitting outside. So that's pretty neat um, so I bought a water trailer, a water tank trailer, and I also bought a placeable water, uh, uh, what's this thing called? A, uh, water tower. And I dropped it right here. So all I have to do is pull up, fill the water thing up, and then come over here and, and fill this up. And it cuts down on travel time and everything else. So I think that's pretty good. Um, and that should be all you have to do is keep them clean. Keep this cleaned out, keep them fed, and you see my stockpile there. I've got plenty. Uh, with two sheep, full bins will feed your sheep for six days in game. So water does the same. Um, I don't know what these are used for yet. I will have another video for you at some point on the follow-up, reproduction, whatever else of sheep. And if we need to do anything else. But right here is where you can pick up your wool. As you can see, I got one bale started in there, and that is uh, it's 13%. Uh, finished on the wool. So uh, I'm guessing there's four to a crate is what it looks like. It looks like there's room for one and then two here. And then it looks like you have enough for uh, maybe six pallets, maybe nine pallets to build up here. So sheep are kind of one of those things you just check periodically and make sure you clean up after them. And if you have a bunch of them, you can get some serious wool going. And wool goes for a pretty decent price last time I checked. So, um, and everything's high right now. That's good. That's a good thing. Uh, see, let's find the wool. So it's at uh, forty nine fifty eight right now. So uh, f I don't know if that's for one bale. Like I said, I'll do a follow up video on sheep. I just wanted to let you know the basics of what you would need to get started. Uh, it costs two hundred dollars to have them delivered, or uh, you can buy the trailer and something to pull it with, and you can deliver them here if you buy them and deliver them yourself instead of paying that extra two hundred dollars. And after a while, I mean, if you buy enough animals, it would be worth buying the, the trailer because you will save uh, $200 for each animal you buy. So if, you're pl if you plan on buying a bunch of animals and doing less uh, actual farming, uh, crop farming, and you want to do more animal farming, then uh, you'll probably want to go ahead and buy a trailer. So um, any thoughts on that, you guys let me know. Again, I will do a follow-up video. Uh, I do play... Uh, quite a bit. I do not use any kind of money tools or uh, cheats or mods or anything like that. So everything I do, you can see I'm negative right now. So everything I do is um, is uh, 
is is pretty much me trying to earn the money to get up more equipment and more things so uh, I will have more sheep at some point and we will see you know the production rate of 10 sheep versus two sheep that kind of thing uh, I might do an AB on how quickly you can get sheep with and without clean I mean uh, wool with and without cleanliness and all that kind of stuff we'll have to see though uh, thank you so much for watching. Leave your thoughts and comments uh, in the comment section below. Please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it, if it helped you out any. And if you want to see more of these, subscribe to the channel. Thanks so much, guys. Later.